One of the great new features in UCAM 5 is the ability to import PowerPoint files so you can make better, more effective video presentations, whether you're recording or using online video chat clients like Skype. So let's take a quick look at how to do it. Up the top here you'll see three modules, Effects, Presentations, Utilities. Click Presentations and then Create Presentation. Now at this point you have a choice. You can either drag and drop the PowerPoint file you want to use into the box here, or you can click the folder icon and locate the file on your hard drive. Open it and UCAM will then import that file into the UCAM UI. Now when you've got your presentation slides into UCAM, you'll notice that there are a number of different layout options. And you'll find that connecting with your audience is made most effective when they can not only see the slides you're referencing, but they can see your face at the same time. Now the full screen view we have here is probably best for introducing yourself and your topic. Once you start in the slides themselves, you want to switch to something like this, which puts the focus on the slides. However, at the same time, you can see in the bottom corner, we always have a view of the speaker. Now you can flip through your slides and introduce each one, discuss the topics. When you get to something like this, where the video is obscuring some of the text, perhaps some important piece of information that the audience needs to see, it's a simple matter of flicking to a full screen slide view. And you can change back and forth between these quite easily. Now another option we have here is what we call speaker mode. This puts the focus back on the speaker, but at the same time you can see which slide the speaker is on quite easily here. Now this is good if your audience has a printout perhaps of the PowerPoint you're referencing or they have their own PC with a digital copy of the PowerPoint on that and they're following it on their own side. So they don't, it's not so important that they're able to read what's on the slide, more that they're able to see what you're saying and see which slide you're referencing. A final option is side-by-side -side mode and basically this gives a good full screen view of the slide you're talking about but at the same time also has a video view of the speaker on the side which doesn't obscure any of the text. UCAM also provides tools you can use to draw on your presentation to highlight different points you're making. So for instance in the graph here, if there's a certain section you'd like to draw your audience's attention to, you can use the drawing tool to do this. UCAM also offers the choice of different colours and brush sizes. So there you have it, a great new way to make effective PowerPoint video presentations with UCAM 5.